Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel, The Savvy Professor. In today's video, I will show you how to make a pie chart on Google Forms. Now, this process can only be done in PC, so make sure to watch the video till the very end. So first of all, you just need to open up your browser and there you will search for forms.google.com. Now here you will click on the first link and then log into your Google account. Now over here, we will just open any form. Now here, one thing you need to keep in mind is that you cannot make a pie chart within the Google Forms. So you can just import it or insert it. So for this one, we will make the pie chart within the Google Sheets. For that, you need to click on the response tab that you will find on the top center of the screen. Once you are here, you need to click on this green plus icon on the top right hand side of the screen. This will take you to your Google Sheets. Now over here, you just need to select all of this data. After you are done selecting it, you need to click on the insert tab and from this drop down menu, you will select the chart option. Now this will present a chart in front of you, but from the right hand side of the screen, from this tab, you can change the chart type. So right below the chart type, you need to click on this column chart option and this drop down will appear in front of you. Here you need to scroll down a bit and you will be able to see this pie chart. So just click on the pie chart and as you can see, all data is converted into pie chart. Now, within Google Sheets, you can also customize this chart. So for that, you need to click on the Customize tab. And from this first option, we'll just click on Background Color to change the background color of this chart. And after you're done selecting it, right beside that, you can see Font. So you can select the font also. So I'll just select Arial. And then if you scroll down a bit, you can see you can reset the layout also. So I'll just tick on a 3D. And then if you scroll down a bit, over here, you can also label these slides. So you can label them, give them value. So I'll just click on percentage over here. And then you can also select the font for the label. You can change the color. And once you are done with all that, we'll just go back. So just click on cross. Now we will download this pie chart that we have created. For that, you need to click on these three dots that you can see on the top right hand side of this chart. And from this drop down menu, you will select the download chart option. And then you will select the image type, which says PNG image. And this will download this pie chart. Now you need to go back to your Google Forms. And over here, you will click on the questions tab. And then you scroll down a bit. And right beside this question, you can see this image icon. So just click on the image icon. And you will be able to upload the file from here. So just click on upload. And then browser. And then on the download from the finder. And then you can select any image. So I'll just select the pie chart that you have created and then you'll click on open. And just like that, the pie chart will be uploaded. So that's it for this video. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, then don't forget to smash that like button and also subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching the video till the very end. I will see you in the next one. Till then, take care.